Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to discuss how we generate the report by using the PyTest Selenium in XML format, Excel format, and HTML format. So, three type of reporting I will show here by using the PyTest and Selenium. Okay, so let me remove the reports which is generated earlier. Now, if we want to generate the reports into XML format, so I am going to run all the test which is available under the Selenium Py test folder under this folder, and you will see test will execute a report will generate. Okay, so if we want to run the test, we need to call the Py test. Okay, folder name selenium test and then pass here junit xml equal to report name and run the test so it will run all the test and once the test execution done, it will generate the report into the XML format and I will show you the report. So all the test execution done, you can see here there are three tests failed and five passed. And if you look here, there is a report.xml file is created. If I go into the folder, you can see here is the report. Let me open this in uh, browser. So here you can see the test fail test, one test fail, second test fail, and third test fail. Three test fail, and there are five tests passed. One, two, three, four, five. For past test, we will not see any logs errors. Only if the test is getting failed, we will see the failure. What is the reason why the test is failing? We can see in the details as well as message assertion is inserted here. What is the issue? Okay, now let me show you how we generate the report into HTML format. So this is XML format. If we want to generate the report into HTML format, here we need to pass HTML then equal to file name report.html now test is started running again for the html report okay so test execution completed here you can see three tests failed again and here uh, at the root report html file is created if i open this you can see let me open on the browser and here you can see the details we can see what is the platform what is the plugin right icon version java home as well as summary here eight tests run in 48 second and here we have some option we can filter the test how many tests fail and how many passed accordingly we can also filter here and if you want to look the errors log you can see here these are the failure message okay and all the tests these tests are passed if we have any output output also will capture here okay but as of now i have not added any output so now the report is generated you can see this is HTML report. Okay, next, how we generate the CSV report? So, for, for CSV report, we need to install the one Python module. So, basically, here you can see the Python module name a pip install pytest excel. We need to install this first, then we can generate because this is not default Python module for the pytest. So, first run the pip install pytest excel. Okay, install the package. Done. Okay. 
let me show how we generate the report into the uh, excel format so if you can see look here there is a hyphen hyphen excel report and then pass the report excel as file name let me run so first we need to use pytest and then as additional parameter excel report report dot xls run this again it will run all the test right and at the end we will see one excel report file will generate Yeah, all the test execution done again three tests fail and if you look here there is a report.xls file is generated if i go into the folder you will see here excel report let's open this yes here we will get all the details if there is any description we can say description first file name right then test name description is coming here result duration how much time it takes to execute then we have also time time stamp message in message basically we will see what is the error we are getting and then we have here file name okay first one is test name now this is file name and this is marker right any marker is available and uh, our test is parameter right? these marker we can get also here so this is very nice we can get all the details of the re uh, like uh, reports in excel format and we can also apply the filters here to check how many tests pass and fail uh, right like only fail test selected so in that case we can see all the fail test if we apply this for filter for past we can see the past test details now if we want to capture only the uh, details not generate the report right we need to pass hyphen hyphen collect only in that case we will get only the uh, details of the test in excel format it will not execute the test let me show you Test pass select only and you can see test is not executed right and we can see a test collected and stored into the x excel format let me show you what we can see in this time so this time you can see the shoot name then we have test name then we have here file name marker okay there is no uh, status we are not getting because here test is not executed that's why we are not able to see the uh, status so in that case if we want to collect all the test all the created tests in excel sheet excel format we can create excel sheet using this feature Okay, hope this will be helpful to understand how we generate the report using the PyTest Selenium in XML format, HTML format, as well as the in Excel format. Okay, and if you like the tutorial, please click on the like button, as well as share this tutorial to your friends, colleague, and subscribe the channel and leave a comment if you have any query. Thanks for watching the.